Baltimore County Executive Johnny Oshevsky is live with us this morning with a look into what the county has already done to keep you safe out there. Good morning. Good morning, Stefan and Diana. Now tell us about the works, the preparations for this winter storm and the season, upcoming storms that may happen throughout the year. Yeah, thanks so much for covering this morning. It looks like we have a wet, windy, chilly day with a, with a mix. But as always, our crews in Baltimore County are ready and standing by. We cover about 173 snow routes and almost 6,700 miles of roadway uh, with about 500 personnel and about 400 pieces of equipment. And uh, we have our salt domes throughout Baltimore County. We pre-treat when appropriate. We did not in this instance because of the rain that we're expecting and, and the mix that would sort of offset that. But um, both for this storm and always, we're ready. Um, we're standing by, and uh, again, we're encouraging residents, if they don't have to be on the roads, mm. you know, stay off the roads. Certainly with the Ravens game today, for anyone venturing out, uh, we encourage folks to give themselves extra time, uh, to be thoughtful, to be careful, to keep their headlights on. But uh, please know that our crews are out there. We have a lot of roadways to care for. And typically the rule of thumb in Baltimore County is give us 24 hours from the last drop of snow or ice as it might be to really make sure that we've done our treatments and the roadways are actually clear. But if you have to be out there, we ask folks to please take their time. All right. Well, I guess if you're not going to the Ravens game, you don't have to go to work. Johnny O says stay at home. All right, Mr. Executive, thank you so much for joining us. Stay safe, everybody. Thanks.